So a couple of weeks back, I was browsing through the competition and I began to realize that certain mans think they're bad, you get me? Cough, cough. And seeing as I'm 100% certified OG triple G triple out uh, here, on my way to Bethlehem, I decided to switch to free aim and show mans how it's done out here in some of it, you get me? <laughs> What's up YouTube, BTM boy, back at you with another video. Still struggling to pay rent, living off bread and water. So be sure to smash the subscribe button and help me feed my one and a half children. So other than that guys, let's get straight to today's video. After taking some time to calibrate my pistol and tie my shoelaces, I headed to the front line, where straight away, a man from the hood was running up the hill. I moved on to hide behind a wooden cosmetic item when my blood clot pad disconnected. After reorientating myself, a breader started to rush, man. So I started running around climbing fences, hoping to catch a man out, which just ended up getting my head blown off. However, I ended up side by side with a female primate. Shots was fired. Ah. Running to my death, I decided to take this shit to the streets. If you're enjoying this video, be sure to go check out my previous gameplay and subscribe to the channel. After entering free roam, guys, I showed no mercy on the first target I saw. It's a shame the NPCs have better aim than me, fam. I decided to leg it, but didn't get far. Cut two. I was about to blow a his head off when something caught my eye. So I proceeded to investigate the scenario only to realize what I saw was a man pointing his high powered BB gun right at me. I swear fam I was about to light him up when a horse and carriage casually trampled me. Then a motherfucker violently displaces my lower lumbar. However, I've had vigorous Lithuanian Jiu Jitsu training in Smevik, allowing me to gumbuck the stranger who tried to rear mount me. I did a quick 180 and gave chase to the original suspected bystander. Standard. To be honest, he got caught slipping. And then I got caught slipping. I tried to do one of those drop and roll things I saw the next man doing, but he felt stupid. And the guy just came out from behind the tree like, WTF are you doing, fam? I died again before going to the local dealership to kick up a fuss because man's giving me this crappy Prius when I've got a fresh ass one series already there. So I rolled out in the one series and I accidentally pressed the wrong button and nearly bitch slapped a local. Shortly after that, I rolled up on two strays who seemed to be working together. In my defense, fam, in my defense, this one series, yeah, you've sometimes got a double clutch. And then the same stray killed me again. I had to do a quick settings adjust because my free aim wasn't set to off when on horseback. And I saw another n dipping and cut a quick left like I couldn't see him. But I did see him, so I followed him and clapped him up in the bush. <laughs> Leaving man sprawled out, so I just had to end his struggle and a quick thing. So I rather didn't realize his bedroom was 20 meters away until he started coming at me so I opened fire and he did that stop drop and roll thing and fucked me up which ultimately gave him the upper hand. I was heading back to get certified revenge when I saw a chicken shop and might want to hit up on the way back causing me to take my eyes off the road for a hot sec and snap him on there. I got back to my feet, but two seconds later, another malaria carrier shot my horse mid sprint and instead of scrapping it, he shot me too. I proceeded with a newfound bad man mentality and found a fresh born and he raw nearly done my dance with that stop drop and roll shit but I got him and his horse tried to get up a couple moments later so I slept that too Riding into the boulevard, I saw another innocent bystander attempt to mount his horse. Seeing as I've got certified free aim, horseback turning a corner at the same time, sharpshooting skills. I missed my first two shots, not realizing who he was starting a confrontation with. He took off, you get me? Jesus. The suspect was getting off and some feds was in the way, so I thought YOLO. Not to know that the horse stood there was like a statue. And catching his head, it will send me eight feet into the air. I raw lost heart, fam, but I attempted to track him into the outskirts, only to realize that there was three of them out there on some cult shit. After getting dead up once, I decided to take a knee to the god in hope of four coming to Batman's cage. Nonetheless, I went full savage before getting brutally shot by a lawman. So I decided I need to try a new method of attack. I call this free aim is bullshit. I'm just gonna trample you with my horse. 
which didn't work, so I circled back on the mad one. I spawned across the river and hid behind this tree while I contemplated the possibility of a penile infection after entering the water ahead. But I thought fuck it and entered it anyway and got shot. I decided to scale the bridge outside St. Dennis for a better angle. Twos twos, the next man's running straight at me fam. Oh, he was crossing the bridge. I weren't sure if he could see me or not, so I took a chance. Next thing you know, man looked at me, cut a left. Naturally, being from the hood, I panicked and fell off the bridge. Somehow, managing to get a sneaky back flank on him. I should have done him, but I fucked it. And he pulled the next Darren Brown thing, fam, and teleported to the other side of the bridge like it weren't nothing. I shot one or two shots and fell off again. So I thought, allow it, I'll run him and got shot. Pretty much guys, um, I think the moral of this story is that free aim is no joke Yeah, I didn't have slippery bastard and I didn't really use dead eye or nothing But at the end of the day, I tried it with what I've got just even the fact of aiming alone is not easy, bro I don't do well in high pressure scenarios on games. That's all I can see as soon as a high pressure scenario comes or oh, or oh, it's the fan you get me you want to see me on rust guys if you guys know rust it's a badass game you gotta play rust whenever I, I build the sickest base and the first man that comes like he could be a naked and i'll just fucking panic and uh, i just end up giving him the keys to the base or something stupid this is the first of many to come guys it's gonna be like a new series so this one was kind of a practice but um obviously i tried to do the best practice i could so expect future videos to maybe have a little bit more of a story to it but um if you guys enjoyed this one be sure to give me a huge thumbs up i'd appreciate every last one of them subscribe to the channel if you want to see similar videos and more content from your boy you get me so help me keep the lights on out here and help me feed my one and a half children and other than that guys i love every one of y'all i'll see you in the next video and we out <laughs>